I've been doing light painting for over 20 years and this is my favorite stuff to do because every time I do it, it's different. If it's cloudy day, that's okay. I don't have to have sun. I don't have to have a bright day. The only thing I'd prefer not to have is rain. Like I say, when, I, when I'm doing this, I'm always, I get, I try to get here at least 15 minutes beforehand, scope out uh, my composition, try to figure out what's gonna be the best, think about it. But what makes this work is that you have, one has to have the, the exposure long enough so you can move with the light. Normally direct light on the subject is very harsh and unappealing, but since this light is moving it has a very soft feel to it, yet it's direct. And the shadow areas are getting lit up while I'm moving. The statue is so dark, I have to wait for the sky to get quite a bit darker before I can even start to fool with this. However, I'll be lighting it with this guy. Of course, like I say, you got a lot of things going on. I got people running around out here, crazy, kind of a wild, crazy guy with these lights, and they're probably gonna get out of my way. Maybe not. Right now, we're at about eight seconds at F22. My sky is still a little bit too hot. Front light is boring. It looks like a car light. And that's the, one of the, the big things about light painting is that it needs to be done from the side or the back, back light. All right. So right now, we have arrived. We're at the point now where it's all coming together. The city's coming alive at night with the lights coming on in the buildings. And, Having a light come out of those windows really gives the photograph a lot more depth. There's still some things I'm not getting. All right. This time I'm keeping the blue on one side to maybe simulate like a street light or something. You know, sometimes I try to do that just to try to simulate moonlight. It can simulate street light. This one thing, this little shadow area back here. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Oh yeah, it's all good. Man. I'm getting ready to change angles. It's getting darker now, so I'm going to be lowering my f-stop down to probably about 14. You can shoot it in the night, you know, as long as you want. It's just that you get a black sky. And when once you have a black sky, a lot of depth is lost. Look at this. Yes, sir. That is the shot.